So, do you need a full-featured PDF editor like Adobe Acrobat Pro DC? In this video, I'm going to show you how to install free PDF 2025 on your system with a lifetime giveaway subscription, for free. Let's jump right in. First, open your favorite browser and head to Google. Search for free office. The first result should take you to freeoffice.com. This is the free office website from SoftMaker, the folks behind this software. You can download and install this free suite on pretty much any device, Windows, Mac, Linux, or even your phone. But what we're really here for is the free PDF 2025 editor, right? So scroll down to the bottom of the page and you'll find a link to the free PDF 2025 website. Once you're on the free PDF site, take a moment to scroll through and check out the features this PDF editor offers. When you're ready to download, just hit the download button. You'll be taken to a registration page that looks something like this. Fill in all the required info, your name, email, country, and then claim your free subscription key, which will be sent to your email. Before you get that key though, make sure to confirm your email address. Check your inbox for a verification code, enter it to verify, and you're good to go. Once that's done, the free PDF 2025 installer will start downloading automatically, and you'll also see your subscription key on screen. Plus, it'll land in your mailbox too. The download might take a couple of minutes, so just hang tight until it's finished. When it's done, find the installer file on your computer and run it to install free PDF 2025. After installation, open the app. The first time you launch it, you'll see a pop-up like this. Here, you'll need to enter your product key. You can either use the one you got from the registration or request a free key using the second option. Since we already have ours, we'll just pop it in to activate our free copy of Free PDF 2025. Next, I like to tweak some settings to make it more comfortable for reading PDFs. I'd recommend exploring all the settings and options in the app. Adjust them to suit your preferences. Now, let's open a sample PDF and see how you can edit your files. Honestly, I think this PDF editor is pretty easy to use. There are tons of editing options available, and I'll let you play around with those on your own. So, that's it. I hope you found this helpful. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below, and I'll catch you in the next one.